to be honest, I was never really into that much, into foam rolling that much until I started to get symptoms from my thoracic outlet syndrome and to be dehydrated. And even though I was drinking a lot of water, it didn't seem to be getting into my tissues. And so I have found that foam rolling with a soft foam roller has really created more flexibility in um, muscles that need that um, flexibility or uh, hydration. And I've also found that it has relieved tension around those joints where my connective tissue and muscles tend to tighten up from lack of hydration. So I plan on offering a foam rolling class and I am offering a class because, although a foam rolling class does not sound exciting, <laughs> um, I'm offering a class because I think it's important to be consistent with the foam rolling and it just can be so hard to do if you're just doing it by yourself. The other reason or another reason that I want to offer a class is that we often, if we're foam rolling on our own or self massaging on our own, we just do the same tight areas every time. We don't go into other areas that might need a little love and attention, but we don't think about them because we're used to our own program. So I will take you on a journey of other areas that might need a little bit of love. And also we will not be rolling out the IT band, that super painful for a lot of people um, tissue down the side of the hip. We will be working on, or side of the thigh, we will be working on other things, so don't worry about that. And we will be using a soft foam roller, or I will encourage you to purchase a soft foam roller so that your tissues can really, or so that the foam roller can really get into the tissues and around the tissues in a soft manner that is not creating any more tension. So if this sounds like something you might be interested in, please drop a comment below or DM me. And you can also check out my uh, IGTV video on hydrating uh, the tissues and the importance of that. Thanks.